quick note. I'm going to show you something real quick. Got the cover off. Yeah, could maybe scroll in there a little bit, but I guess not. Right behind here. See these guys right here? These tips? Real important. You don't break these when you pull them off. But these are what's getting replaced. As well as that gasket back there because it's going to get torn up anyway when you pull the cover off. Alright, so what you have here is you have the flame sensor. And you have the two electrodes. Okay? They get replaced every single time. Down below here, we got a filter. Tankless water heater is a very restrictive unit. Very restrictive. They're phenomenal, but when they're not taken care of, boy, they can be a hindrance. They can be a real bitch. So, this gets changed every time. It doesn't matter how clean it is when it comes out. For five bucks, toss it in the garbage and throw another one in. There's no sense not. I'm also going to try and clean up any debris that's in here. I didn't bring my shop back up because I'm, I'm upstairs. i kind of give you a glance of where I am. Ooh. So, it's a little tight coming up there. My shop back is big, but I'll take a rag. You know, I always bring shop, shop rags up and kind of wipe it down. Generally, I'll go outside and I'll go to the back end of my vent here, make sure that there's nothing in the bird cage. No birds in the bird cage. <laughs> Usually, it is not. Usually, it's pretty clean, but it's always worth checking on. But there we go. So, what I'll do is I'll pull these guys out and we'll get to uh, get going on number one here, or number 11, I should say. This is Bill of Harlow Plumbing, Greenville, South Carolina. All is going to 101. Stay tuned.